Enforcement Administration is partnering with local law enforcement for the 22nd National Drug Take Back Day, where people can take their old prescription meds and give them to the proper authorities to dispose of. Western Mass News reporter Glenn Clindle has the details. The CDC estimates over 100,000 people in the U.S. died last year due to prescription drug poisoning. Local police are partnering alongside the DEA in hopes to quell those numbers with the National Prescription Drug Take Back Day. They have 4,000 locations today that are doing drop offs for uh, prescription medication, things like that, that you know uh, you want to safely um, discard. During the last drug take back day in April 2022, the U.S. returned over 700,000 pounds of prescription medication. The base state alone returned nearly 27,000 pounds of prescription meds. Sergeant Morales tells Western Mass News residents of Springfield returned just over 800 pounds of prescription drugs. This location does about 30 boxes of these size. And then we also, um, other uh, police departments bring their boxes here as well. Morales adds the day allows them to keep these drugs from making their way to the street. With the, uh, you know, the drug issues that we have currently, uh, this is definitely a step to help alleviate that. Um, and at the same time, we do come across uh, situations where family members don't know what to do with the, the, the pills of a, a member that's passed. Or Reporting in Springfield, Glenn Kittle, Western Mass News.